and welcome to Nuclear Dawn Help 106. This is going to be a second look on Clock Tower for Empire. So starting out, we have been selected as commander. We jump into the bunker, command bunker, and uh, I try to build that first one up the left. Same strategy as uh, last look, Nuclear Dawn 106. I sold off one of the forward spawns to get a little bit of extra cash, research, field tactics, then I build the next uh, relay tower. Same exact strategy as before. Put up the forward spawn as soon as possible. Get some independent power. Build the armory. Put another relay tower up to extend the range. Sold off the relay towers in the back. Since we have independent power, it'll give me a little bit of a cash boost. Now I do advanced kits right away. Then I start building out more towards the right. I refortify it with uh, uh, with another forward spawn and some some supplies for the exos. And uh, their guys started trying to build up as quickly as possible. Now I do want to point out that I tried to get all of the exos to try to really focus on. Uh, cutting them off at the base or at the steps, forward steps. I put a, rock, I put a machine gun turret for a little bit of uh, backup and I started building up uh, again right here. Again, more supplies. An optional... Uh, uh, now, of course, their, their team was doing pretty good, so they kept destroying our structures, but we still had enough money right there. That's where I really want them to really cut off, uh, cut off the enemy so that way it cuts all their power off built another forward spawn a little bit further up. We don't want our guys to be forced to have to come down uh, a narrow pathway in drowning grenades. And uh, I'll decide to go ahead and give them another option. Go ahead and come down the backside here as well. Now, their guys try to come around because they realized I had power uh, more towards the middle of the map. Then next, uh, my men try to focus on taking out that power generator because once they're cut off from the steps, the power generator is the only thing keeping the power up. I kept rebuilding supplies because uh, you know they kept shooting them down. Built another forward spawn over here so that way they could go down the underground tunnel if they chose. More supplies, keep your XLs full of ammo. Now our XOs are shooting the enemy from two different directions, from the left and from the south. Put more supplies down, just really easy. Just kept throwing down supplies for all of my men. That way they have uh, lots of ammo. They won't have to be uh, spawning a whole lot. All these turrets and all these extra structures force me to have to build another uh, power generator. So I throw one down right there. Kept building supplies nonstop. As you can see, all my guys are taking a lot of hits. Just keep building up, up the left as well. Finally, we're getting them a little bit boxed in, so now our guys are able to come from two different directions. Put a forward spawn behind that wall, and of course, drop more supplies. Meanwhile, the guys that are a little bit further up on the upper left side are still working their way into primary. Extend the range. Put another uh, turret down so their engineers wouldn't try to take out my power generators later on. Drop another forward spawn right behind the white bus because this is now going to be the next uh, big section to defend. Then uh, now that I have a, a little bit more money and we also have primary, I decided to reinforce secondary in a couple of our other weak spots and primary as well. And then pretty much we just kept building up, trying to do our best to build out towards the right. Researched advanced manufacturing. And then just keep trying to do your best to just keep throwing down supplies for all of your men as, as often as possible. Put a turret down, some more machine gun turrets. Uh, stick this for um, this relay tower behind that white bus. Uh, throw down some more power now that it's fairly reinforced on the very left side. Again, just keep throwing down supplies. Uh, throw a turret once in a while. Uh, we our, our guys did an excellent job pushing up the middle. So we built a lot of structures coming up there. 
I tried to reinforce it with some more uh, turrets. I also put a turret in front of the parking garage. And uh, since the middle, uh, the enemy was actually more concerned about clearing out the middle, I took advantage of this to build up the right. So the middle is actually very easy for them to take back. They just need to just drown us in grenades. But by the time they had eliminated everything in the middle, we were already fairly far up the right hand side. So just you know, keep reinforcing the right hand side with more supplies, more forward spawns, more turrets. There's some supplies in a forward spawn coming right off on that corner. And as, as soon as I get four grand, I throw another uh, rocket turret down. It'll help give a little bit of uh, moderate cover. Then we focus building back up on the middle again, because this is where they can cut us off on the right hand side. Keep putting supplies up for your men as often as possible. Now we actually ran out of time. We weren't able to uh, finish them off, but this is a lot better example of how uh, we actually can still win this map. Thank you very much for watching. Comment, like, subscribe, uh, leaving your feedback. Thank you.